until we arrived at the water's edge. And if you remember, there were a lot of times that Jesus went down by the lake shore, uh, the lake of Galilee. Uh, several times he gave sermons from the shore of the lake and uh, from the bow of the boat. And one of the things that I thought about when we were going to do this around the lake is that passage uh, from the psalmist, Psalms 23, about how God takes care of us. Psalms 23. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He restores my soul. He leads me in right paths for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the darkest valley, I fear no evil. For you are with me, and your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil, and my cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord my whole life long. You know, the, the part I love about that is still waters. You know, a, a sheep won't drink from running water. If we had sheep here, they would want to be at a place where the water's calm and not being disturbed by the flow of the river or the flow of the creek. And we also experience in our own lives disturbance, things that make us afraid, things that make us jumpy. Uh, we're going through some of that right now. And so we know that there are people who are anxious and concerned and who need the comfort of Christ in their lives. Let's have a prayer for them. God, for all of those who fear, for those who are afraid, for those who need to feel your comforting presence, we pray this day and ask that you will bless them. And then, Father, we ask for hope. Hope for a different tomorrow than today is. A day when we don't have to worry about becoming sick. So we're making our walk back around to the point we started. We're going to go down by the nature center where we will have our scripture. You know, it's an amazing thing to be here by this lake and these mountains on this day, a bright and beautiful sun and just feeling this place and the comfort it brings to so many.